Hi everybody! It's Sue from the library. Welcome to library story time. I don't know what Monkey's doing sat there. <laughs> I think he's got his mischief head on again. I think we should begin today's story time with three little monkeys. <laughs> Can you remember the words and the actions? Three little monkeys jumping on the bed. One fell off and bumped his head. Mummy called the doctor and the doctor said, No more monkeys jumping on the bed. Two little monkeys jumping on the bed. One fell off and bumped her head. Mummy called the doctor and the doctor said, no more monkeys jumping on the bed. One little monkey jumping on the bed. He fell off and bumped his head. Mummy called the doctor and the doctor said, Put those monkeys back to bed. <laughs> well done if you remembered the words and the actions. I hope Monkey enjoyed it. <laughs> I wonder what today's story is going to be. I better have a look in the story time basket. Oh, this is a lovely story. Today's story is called Rabbit Nap. And it's a big thank you to Julia Donaldson, who wrote this story, and to Axel Scheffler, who's drawn the fantastic illustrations. Now, this storybook is part of the Tales from Acorn Wood series. Remember we had Fox's Socks a little while ago? That was from Acorn Wood too. So it's a big thank you to Macmillan Publishers once again <laughs> for allowing us to use this storybook at story time. Thank you. <sighs> ah, rabbits feeling sleepy. She curls up in a chair. Tap, tap. Who's that? Oh dear. It's Build-A-Bear. Where can Rabbit have her nap? The window seat looks nice. Bang, crash. Who's that? Oh no, a band of mice. Rabbits in her deck chair. A doze would be, oh, so good. Whack, crack. Who's that? It's Fox. He's chopping wood. A shady tree, said Rabbit. Oh, the kind of spot I like. Ding-a-ling! Who's that? Who could it be? It's Tortoise on his bike. Poor tired rabbit goes back home. She yawns ah, and rubs her eyes. rat a tat tat Who's that? Should we have a look? Your friends with a surprise. Hush a bunny, tra la la, we'll sing you off to sleep. What's that? Shall we have a peep? Oh, it's Rabbit fast asleep. Sweet dreams, Rabbit. Oh, 
Oh, that was a lovely story. I'm glad Rabbit finally got to sleep. <laughs> I know another bunny who likes to sleep. <laughs> Do you? Should I have a look in the basket and see if I can find sleeping bunny? Oh, here's Sleeping Bunny. I bet Sleeping Bunny enjoyed Rabbit's nap. <laughs> See if you can find a space on the floor and curl up, just like a Sleeping Bunny. See the little bunny sleeping till it's nearly noon. Shall we wake them with a merry tune? Oh, how still are they ill? Wake up soon. Shh. Wake up, bunnies! Hop, little bunnies, hop, hop, hop. Hop, little bunnies, hop, hop, hop. Hop, little bunnies, hop, hop, hop. Hop and stop. Should we sing it one more time? Go back to sleep, bunnies. See the little bunnies sleeping till it's nearly noon. Shall we wake them with a merry tune? Oh, how still are they ill? Wake up soon. Shh. Wake up, bunnies! Hop little bunnies, hop, hop, hop. Hop little bunnies, hop, hop, hop. Hop little bunnies, hop, hop, hop. Hop and stop. Give yourselves a clap, well done. Sleeping bunnies slept through it all. <laughs> I put him back into the basket. Now we haven't sung this for quite a while. Who can be a jelly? <laughs> Stand up and wibble wobble like a jelly. Are we ready to sing jelly on a plate? Jelly on a plate, jelly on a plate. A wibble wobble, wibble wobble, jelly on a plate. <laughs> Let's sing it one more time. Jelly on a plate, jelly on a plate, a wibble wobble, wibble wobble, jelly on a plate. <laughs> oh, it's always a good one, jelly on a plate. <laughs> I think I'll ask Dolly to join us now and we can sing Miss Polly Had a Dolly. Are you ready to rock your dollies? Miss Polly had a dolly who was sick, sick, sick. So she called for the doctor to be quick, quick, quick. The doctor came with his bag and his hat and he knocked on the door with a rat-a-tat-tat. He looked at the dolly and he shook his head. Then he said, Miss Polly put her straight to bed. He wrote on a paper for a bill, bill, bill. I'll be back in the morning, yes I will, will, will. Should we sing it one more time? Miss Polly had a dolly who was sick, sick, sick. So she called for the doctor to be quick, quick, quick. The doctor came with his bag and his hat and he knocked on the door with a rat-a-tat. He looked at the dolly and he shook his head. Then he said, Miss Polly put us straight to bed. He wrote on a paper for a bill, bill, bill. I'll be back in the morning, yes I will, will, will. Let's have wind the bobbin next. Can you make a bobbin? Wind the bobbin up, wind the bobbin up, pull, pull, clap, clap, clap. 
Wind it back again, wind it back again. Pull, pull, clap, clap, clap. Point to the ceiling, point to the floor. Point to the window and point to the door. Clap your hands together, one, two, three. And place your hands upon your knee. Now let's make a big bobbin. And this time, let's sing as loud as we can so everybody can hear us at story time. Are we ready? Wind the bobbin up, wind the bobbin up, pull, pull, clap, clap, clap. Wind it back again, wind it back again, pull, pull, clap, clap, clap. Point to the ceiling, point to the floor, point to the window and point to the door. Clap your hands together, one, two, three, and place your hands upon your knee. After that loud bobbin, oh, we better have a quiet bobbin. Let's make a tiny bobbin. Wind the bobbin up, wind the bobbin up, pull, pull, tap, tap, tap. Wind it back again, wind it back again, pull, pull, tap, tap, tap. Point to the ceiling, point to the floor, point to the window and point to the door. Tap your hands together, one, two, three. And place your hands upon your knee. And last of all, who can make a fast bobbin? <laughs> can you do that? <laughs> wind the bobbin up, wind the bobbin up, pull, pull, clap, clap, clap. Wind it back again, wind it back again, pull, pull, clap, clap, clap. Point to the ceiling, point to the floor. Point to the window and point to the door. Clap your hands together, one, two, three, and place your hands upon your knee. Oh, it's harder than it looks. <laughs> well done. I think I'll have another look in the story time basket to see who's there. Oh, it's fish. Are we ready to do some counting? One, two, three, four, five. Once I caught a fish alive. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Then I let it go again. Why did you let it go? Because it bit my finger so. Which finger did it bite? This little finger on my right. Time has flown again. It's time for our last song if you're happy and you know it. So if you've got a shaker, go and get it. If you haven't, don't worry. Just do some good actions with me. Are we ready? If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it and you really want to show it If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands If you're happy and you know it, stamp your feet If you're happy and you know it, stamp your feet If you're happy and you know it and you really want to show it If you're happy and you know it, stamp your feet If you're Happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray! If you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray! If you're happy and you know it and you really want to show it, if you're happy and you know it, shout hooray, hooray! Oh, give yourselves a big clap! Oh, I hope you've enjoyed today's story time and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.